Hi, hello, my name is Carly and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Here I like to talk about books and things and stuff. And today I thought I would do another like week in my life reading vlog. Really I want to focus on reading um, some books off my fall TBR because it is like the end of October. Where, where has the time gone? And I feel like I have not worked it hard enough on that. And so we're gonna focus on that. I just finished a couple of books and I haven't started anything new yet, but what I'm thinking of starting, we'll start, is Business Casual. Um, this is the fourth book in the Love Light Farm series and it follows Nova and Charlie. I'm really excited to get into this one, but I also, I see really excited. Like, this isn't like my favorite series ever, but I enjoy them. And I've been trying to read each one during each season it takes place in, and this is the last one and the fourth one that takes place during fall. So I like need to read this now. And I kind of feel like if I don't pick it up like right this instant, I'm not gonna read it. So this is gonna be something that I will start today. And then I think my Kindle read, I'm gonna go for, it was a little torn between Heartless Hunter and I think it's, one Dark Window. Um, I think I'm gonna go One Dark Window though. And yeah, I'm gonna really prioritize finishing this stuff, especially this one. I want to finish this within the next few days. And I truly believe this is doable. This is 372 pages. It's a romance book. I've gone through these really quickly. I think I can do this. Um, and so yeah, today is Sunday. I've got like a full week of work ahead, but um, it's also right after our deadline so we're not as busy with stuff and yeah we just had like our first storm weekend and I think it's supposed to be pretty gray and rainy and stuff for the whole week so this is like perfect time to like sit down and read. Just a quick update because I've been very busy tonight and like yeah but I read like 50 pages of business schedule last night and had the oh no feeling when I read it in that I realized I don't really want to read it. I think I'm still going to continue on because I don't know when I'm going to want to read it, but like I'm really not going to want to read it right now. It's probably a bad idea. We'll see. But uh, I will say Nova is me and I am Nova, except I will not be getting a romantic partner at the end of the book. But her desire to like be left alone and not interact with people is me. And then I also started One Dark Window, but I did not get very far in that at all because I was falling asleep. And the only other book I read, well I did read a little bit of the American Supernatural stories that was, um, started the Edgar Allan Poe short story, which is The Fall of the House of Usher. And then, will I count it? It kind of counts, but like I don't know if I'm gonna count it, but I also read like, I read like 20 pages of my textbook, which is like, right now it's covering a topic that I thoroughly went through in college. I have very distinct memories of this class. And yeah, so that's a huge refresher, um, or a huge throwback. But it is what it is. I need to take this test by like next month, at least. I, it's not happening this month because the month is almost over, but I need to take this test next month. So I just like have to, I have to do this and I don't want to do this. <sighs> but I'm tired now. I just finished one of the lectures. Um, I'm gonna like take a shower and watch my show and crochet my, crochet my little thing because um, I'm making a sweater. I hope it turns out well, but I am working on my second arm and then the next part is gonna be putting the pieces together and then crocheting the body because it's like there's two pieces of the front, two pieces of the back, arms, and then the rest of the body um, <clears throat> will be like crocheted around. Anyway, I hope it turns out well because I'm very excited and I've been having a very fun time. It's been a big learning process, but I'm very excited about it. So that's where I'm at for the night. I did like no reading last night i just got too tired and i put it off for too long but i kept trying to read business casual while i was doing my um workout right now so i think i'm in a little bit of a reading mood but i'm not gonna read right now i'm gonna eat dinner which is just show you shin ramen with um with 
dumplings I had and some seaweed. And I think I might turn on a show. Don't know if I'll finish it because I need to do some studying as well. So multiple choice questions, but yeah, I'm gonna do a little bit of relaxing right now before Hi Lily. I do any reading. This is what I have to deal with all the time. She loves to jump up there. fighting off a like migraine all day. We kind of got better after I ate lunch. It's not bad, but my back feels tight. I feel like a knot in the back and my shoulder has been bugging me and it's just been super duper fun. Um, but my mom just left. She's going on a trip for a week so I get the house to myself for a week. And my brother's gone. And yeah, I read quite a bit last night. Well, yeah, quite a bit. I don't know. Over 50 pages. They're I only read, oh my gosh, ouch, oh, 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 I'm laying on a tennis ball right now. I read Business Casual last night and got to the point where they started to have some spicy time and I wanted to try to finish in, like reading that whole part, but I could not keep my eyes open anymore. So I uh, stopped. So I stopped. I'll read a little bit more later. I need to answer some multiple choice questions with my studying. It's like being back in school right now. Like what I'm learning about is like one of the classes that I like distinctly remember because it's was one of the harder class. Wait, hi. Oh, <laughs> um, it was one of the harder classes I had to take for my degree. And so it's very much a review. So I'm not too, too worried about this part because, oh, okay. Um, because I will, it's all kind of coming back to me. So I'm not too worried, but I still need to power through it. And I have a one-on-one -on -one with my boss on Friday and he's gonna ask me again if I've scheduled my test. And I have and I have not scheduled my test because I don't feel ready to schedule my test, but I'm never gonna feel ready. So I just need to schedule the dang test. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna probably procrastinate some more. Hi. And hopefully help make my Shoulder feel better. Here's cat. Hi, Lily. What's up? I just had this whole arm sewn up beautifully, perfectly, and then realized I did it the exact same way as um, the other arm. So basically, I had two left arms. Um, so I have to undo all this work i was hoping to be done and have like a set like a front half of my sweater um and be so proud of that and i gotta redo it oh um so that's super great but tonight is my favorite night of the week aka it's a new 911 episode um and i am so excited so i'll probably i guess work on this well, I watch that, but I was really hoping to have it done and yeah, but I really want to get this done tonight because I'm just like super excited about it. Um, and then like tomorrow I can start the body and start having like an actual sweater to wear. This week has not been a reading week. I feel like I do these when I read in a week, working a whole ass job and then just like don't read because like last night I read like three pages kindle pages three kindle pages it was three kindle pages which is like nothing but i've just like been so 
exhausted when I finally do sit down to read that like reading doesn't happen. You know, sometimes, sometimes we just have those weeks. Sometimes we just have those weeks where reading just doesn't really happen or take pretty. Oh my gosh, totally forgot. I have a one-on-one -on -one with my boss tomorrow. Okay, super de duper. Also been like feeling kind of queasy all day. I don't know, like thinking about food is like, I don't want to eat anything. Come on. But I want to eat candy. Candy doesn't make me feel bad. Anything else makes me feel sick. Come on. Please don't let me fuck this up. It's fine. It's fine. I had kind of messed up on seaming this sleeve anyway. And so now I can have a way to fix it. That's what I'm telling myself. So I don't cry over all this work. Let me tell you, this is not a fast process. I fully remember what I was talking about. I was talking about how all I want to do today is eat candy, which is like not good and will also make me feel sick. But it's also like the only thing I've been able to like not feel sick. Eating. Ugh, come on. And there you are. Sure. Let's do that. Let's go with that. Okay. I need to take a shower. How do I? Where's my mess? Oh, this is scary because I don't want to redo the whole dang thing. Okay. Okay. It's okay. Love the self talk. Okay. You don't need to listen to me. You don't need to listen to me ramble to myself as I figure this out. Look at, can you see? Can we see? Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. I've got like a sweater going on. Look at that. I made that. Did I, is the sleeves like a little too long? Yes. Did I kind of mess up when I seamed the back? Also yes. But like, for the first time making a sweater, this is like turning out so, so cool. Look at that. So excited. We're gonna do bad lighting, which is not unusual for this channel. But it's like eight o'clock at night now. Work was good. Did not get nearly as much done as I would have liked to, but it is what it is. Might do a little bit of work this weekend. I don't know, we'll see. I morally <laughs> don't like that. But also less stress for me on Monday. It is what it is. Um, but I'm tired gonna take a shower and read. Reading front. Reading front. I finally read the first chapter of One Dark Window. Yes, in this entire week I had not gotten past the first chapter of One Dark Window. I finally got past it. But I think I'm gonna take a shower and um, just spend the rest of my night reading. I'm tired though. I had been in such a good reading mood when I started this video. Like I'd just come out of re good reading mood and then I don't know what the hell happened this week but I like have not slept well at all. Like today, today is Sunday. I woke up at 3 a.m. So tired. I'm also in pain so I'm also thinking like that's why. Like I'm in more pain than I feel if that makes sense. I don't know how else to explain what's going on with my body um, and I'm pretty sure that is exactly why I've not been sleeping well. Maybe some stress as well, but it is just a little led to like no reading <laughs> this week. I really hope to finish business casual because I'm realizing I am so romanced out right now. Like I can't wait to finish business casual and then like just read a bunch of fantasy and maybe continue with a classic I've like put on hold months ago. Either way, I am tired, kind of in pain and reading this week did not go how I expected it, but I guess that's what makes it realistic. Thank you so much for watching. I don't really know how to end this video because I never finished anything. I am kind of still laughing myself that I only read one chapter, <laughs> one dark window, but I am about 100 pages left of business casual, so there's something there. Either way, that was this week. That was that week. That was a week in my life, reading wise. Um, if you have anything to say leave it in the comments below and I hope that you have a wonderful rest of your day, night, evening, morning, whatever time it is. I hope it is great 
and I will see you guys again with another video soon. Bye. Say hi.